Well, I don't really have much to say. It's just... There's a link I'm going to be posting in the description that talks about... Why, uh... Females from my home state asking me what I'm doing now. Especially the young ones from 16 to... 24 and the link in the description will pretty much explain to you why these females young as 16 are fucking hitting me up and these are females from my home state and but the people in this link speak about tells you why I enjoy home cooked meals. Because hey, when I was living in my home village, you know, I, the best times I enjoyed eating food was. During the summertime when I was working. Because it was an actual fully loaded full course meal. It, and the way I had first and second, it, it wasn't going to load up the plate with each and every type of fucking thing that the chef shift up. But since uh, food isn't shift up like that anymore, I, I don't make my plates like that either anymore either. But yeah, I... We had the typical meal, you know, steaks and potatoes, you know. Rice or some other vegetable. But, ooh. It didn't matter what I ate first or what I ate last. What, what mattered is that uh, what I put on my plate, I put that on my plate, you know, and then, you know, it's like it was potatoes, peas, corn, 
something vegetable, mixed vegetables that fill up the plate, you know, that'd be my first and second servings of that. You know, then if there was rice, you know, a gravy with rice or ketchup or syrup or mayonnaise, uh, eat that next. Or I eat that first, it didn't matter. You know, everybody always watched me, he's like, how come you don't just put everything on your plate at once? So, like, so, I, so I showed him why, you know, and I, I always made a fucking mess. Always. Most times I'd save the meat for last. You know, steak, hamburger, some other type of fucking deer, goose, seal, whatever, you know, fish, meat, salmon. I'd usually save it for last. <sighs> but yeah, it's, I miss eating good like that. I miss it. Shit, back when I was in my home state, it was like freaking one seventy five for a twelve ounce can of soda. Two bucks for sixteen ounce. Buck ninety five for a one liter. But these were the prices back when I was living there. I don't know what the prices are now. But judging from the what they're saying in the description of the link that I'm sure it is. Uh, I'm guessing it pretty pretty much went up higher. Yeah, that shit was, uh, they just people who make money. I'm complaining about how expensive it is up there.
I mean, it, it's a beautiful scenery up there, you know, throughout the year. But, you know, it's expensive. But, I mean, if you're an ex-junkie, it, it's probably the best place to live, really. Because your money goes to everything you actually need to survive for the year.